The film starts, and we see a boy named Josh, who is waiting for a prominent businessman. Soon, a businessman named Carl and his wife, arrive to Josh. Actually, some people had discovered a new cave, the cave was at a very deep depth, which had a river of water, but no one had been able to find it out yet, where that water came from. And to find out about this, Josh, had been working with his team for a long time. Anyway, Josh meets Carl, they sit in a helicopter and leave for that cave. Carl was very fond of seeing such strange things, and that's why Carl had spent a lot of money. They reach that cave, so Carl's wife is also quite surprised to see all this. Now, when they reach that place and land the helicopter, some workers were leaving with their luggage. When Carl asks them the reason for leaving, they say, that we have come to know that a dangerous storm is going to come here in a while, so you should also leave from here. And the team of Josh's dad was working inside the cave, these people also wanted to remove them. But Carl had come from so far, he says, now whatever happens, we will definitely go down in this cave. We look inside the cave, which was two kilometers deep below. Inside it, Josh's dad's team was still working with their full setup. A female worker who was very good at swimming, was trying to find out, where did the water come from inside this cave? And it is so big, where does it end? So today she was going to go on a new path. Then a man of Josh's dad's team notices that the female worker has become very weak due to not getting sunlight. Because they have been working here for many days, so he stops her to work today. On the other side, Carl's wife was shown the map of this cave, which made her realize how deep and big the cave is. Here Carl tells Josh, see, I will go down before you. So there Carl goes inside the cave with the help of a parachute. Carl's wife was surprised to see the beauty of the cave. Before coming here, Josh's dad and the female worker, had gone into the water. So that they could find out where the water is coming from. While swimming, they find a new way. Josh's dad says that we should go through this new way. First of all, Josh's dad goes. And when the female worker starts following them, she was stuck. Anyway, they help her. They both reached a new place. They could see the water level at that height. But they could not go there. Because if they had gone there, they did not have oxygen to return. Now as soon as they start going back from here, the female worker's oxygen cylinder runs out. Her life was in danger. All this their team is watching on the monitor. The oxygen cylinder was so far, that if they had gone to get it back, they would have died on the way. That's why Josh's dad makes a decision here. He takes off his oxygen mask and puts it on his worker. Then after a while, he put it on himself. Now while doing this, they were able to breathe. But they could not swim. And in this way, both would have died. That's why Josh's dad decides with a heavy heart that he will take his oxygen mask back from his worker. He pushes his worker away. As a result, she died there. Everyone was very sad to see this. But what else he could do, he had no other way. Josh was angry to see all this, because he finds his own dad guilty. But the rest of the team did not consider their head, that is, Josh's dad, is guilty. When Josh's dad brings the female worker's body from the water, he heard everything Josh had said. He tells him to go away in anger. Josh had also heard his dad's words and left. When he comes to Carl, it is shown above that a very big storm was about to come. The people above pack their luggage and leave from here. Because of the heavy rain, all the equipment, the electronic devices were damaged. That's why these people couldn't even tell them in the cave below. When Josh and his companions were trying to get out of the cave, they heard a sound. Actually, it was the sound of water. Now they had only two ways. Either they get out of this cave quickly or get away from the paths where the water was about to come from. There is a lot of water in the cave. When they start going up, there was no one to pull their rope. Because everyone had gone from above, two of them tried to climb up. So the water pressure gets so high that they fell down. The man who was with Josh, they both reached the top. If they wanted, they could have gone from here now. But Josh says, no, I will not go alone like this. I can't leave my dad and the people below in trouble. That's why he goes down to tell them about the storm. When he was going, the water in the cave starts to fill up. The water was constantly coming into the cave. There was Josh's dad's team, Carl, and his wife. Josh's dad tells them to walk on the new path. Here in the cave, where there was nothing a while ago, now that cave was full like the sea. Carl and his wife were also coming here and regretting, why did they make the mistake of coming here? They also had no other option, but to listen to Josh's dad. The first man who was with Josh goes, and behind him was Josh. But because of the water pressure, he falls down. His head hit a stone. When Josh tries to save him, he disappears somewhere in the water. Josh's dad tells everyone here, that my worker and I had found a way. We have to get out of that way. These five people wear their own swimming suits. Carl's wife didn't know how to swim. That's why Josh's dad tells her, that Josh will be with you on this journey, who will support you. 
now one by one, they all get out of that narrow way. But because of the anxiety, Carl's wife got stuck in that way. Josh encourages her that no, you can do it. Anyway, they got out of that way. But Carl's wife's condition gets worse. Carl gives his wife support and makes her sit. Here Carl says that we shouldn't try like this. We have to wait for the rescue team. They will come and save us. But now this couldn't have happened. No one knew about this way. Josh's dad says that if we have to save our lives, then we have to move forward. Unwillingly, Carl and his wife have to listen to Josh's dad. These people were slowly moving forward. But now a worker's condition gets worse. They all reached away, from where the water was flowing very fast. The flow of water was so fast, that if a person fell into it, he would immediately die. But now they decide, that they will cross that way with the help of ropes. The worker's condition was getting worse. He himself stops at one place. He got separated from Josh and his dad, so that he could cross this place quickly. Because he knew that he would die soon, while Josh's dad and Josh were looking for him. But they couldn't find him anywhere. Now there were only four people left. When they come a little further, Carl stops at one place and starts taking pictures. Seeing this, Josh's dad got angry. He takes the camera from Carl and says, that we haven't come here for a visit. Many people died because of you. Now you have to do what I say. Although Carl was very rich, he was also helpless after coming here. Anyway, they move on now, where they had to cross a rock. Josh was very good at climbing mountains. That's why he crossed that rock quickly. Then it was his dad's turn, who was coming with Carl's wife. That's when Carl's wife's leg slips, because of which the wire got stuck in her hair, and she was in a lot of pain. She does not care for her hair, and cuts her hair with a knife, because of which she falls down and immediately dies. Carl was crying a lot about his wife's death, but now nothing could be done. The three of them reach the other side. Carl's condition is very bad. Josh's dad says, according to the map, we have traveled a long way. But now they had a shortage of oxygen. Only one man could go into the water. When Josh's dad and Josh were checking out the way, Carl mistakenly takes the cylinder and goes into the water. Because of which Josh and his dad got stuck there. After a while, Josh's dad sees a way, from where he could see the jungle. But that was also quite far from them. That's when they find a tank there. In that tank, they also found some food. Two days pass in this way, when they were coming back from their old way, they meet Carl, who was now badly injured. He was hungry and was talking like crazy. Carl is happy to see Josh and his dad. He thought they had come to save him, but it wasn't so. Josh's dad doesn't help him anymore, because he had deceived them. When Carl was crying and asking for food, Josh feels pity for him. That's why he gives him food. When Josh goes to look for water, Carl attacks Josh's dad in his madness, because of which he falls on a sharp stone. Because of the injury to his lungs, he couldn't walk at all. When Josh comes back and sees all this, he was now angry at Carl. But Carl himself drowns in water and dies without oxygen. When Josh goes to his dad, his dad says, Son, I'm in a lot of pain, and me, and me. I can't take this anymore. Even though he doesn't want to, Josh has to leave his dad there. He jumped into the water with a small oxygen cylinder. There he sees Carl's body. Even when he comes a little far, he doesn't see anything. His oxygen was about to run out. That's when he sees the light. When he swims a little further, he comes out of the sea. He goes into the open sea and breathes. The fishermen who were sitting by the sea, help him. Josh came out of that dangerous cave. But he lost a lot of his loved ones on this journey. With this, the story of this film also ends here.